Welcome to Amy Learns to Cook. On the show today, we're making slow cooker pulled chicken. As part of this recipe, we're going to be making a homemade barbecue sauce. This is really simple and easy, and you can pretty much set it and forget it. So let's make slow cooker pulled chicken. Okay, our first step is to make our homemade barbecue sauce. And we are gonna start with one cup of ketchup. This is whatever kind is your favorite. Then we're gonna put in a quarter cup of water. Then we're gonna put in two tablespoons of cider vinegar. And we're just going to whisk this really fast to combine. This is sort of our wet ingredients to the barbecue sauce. Just going to whisk this up. And this is going to be sort of our base to it. So now we're going to add our spices. We're going to add two tablespoons of brown sugar. two teaspoons of chili powder and we're going to add one teaspoon each of garlic powder, onion powder, dry mustard, it's looking good, paprika and ground cumin. And then we're going to add a quarter teaspoon of ground allspice. And we're going to go ahead and give that a quick stir. And now we're going to put in one of my special ingredients. Okay, my last special ingredient is some, the juice from some chipotle and adobo. Basically we want to put a little bit of the adobo sauce. How much you put in will really depend on how smoky you want it. You can actually chop up one of the um, chipotles in here and put it in here. I'm just gonna put in like three teaspoons of the adobo sauce. That's gonna give it some extra special flavor. Right, so we're just gonna go ahead and stir that in. We're even going to take a little sample just to test it out, right? Mm. Wow. <laughs> it is really, really good. Okay, now it's time to load the slow cooker. Okay, so now we're just going to put this into our crock pot. And this is just a medium sized crock pot, it's not too big. Um, one thing I can say about crock pots is they are great. Um, they're very inexpensive. You can get a nice crock pot for $30 or $40 at your local discount store. So they're great to have around the house because you can sort of set it and forget it, right? So we are going to put four chicken breasts just inside the crock pot. I'm just going to lay them in here. Got a little bit of my paper stuck to it. And then we're going to put in our sauce just right over the top of our meat. We're just going to stir this up a little bit to com coat all the chicken. Make sure it's nice and coated. 
and we're going to put the lid on. And we are going to cook this on low for about five hours. Um, after five hours, we're going to check the temperature and then we're going to pull the chicken and have a taste. Okay, now it's time to pull the chicken. The chicken has been in the crock pot for five hours in our nice, beautiful sauce. And we're going to take it out. Whoa, it's already falling apart. <laughs> we're going to take it out onto a plate and we're just going to pull it. So we're just going to take two forks and look at it just falls apart. Um, I would say that it's done. So we're just going to pull it real quick. I'm thinking I'm going to eat this on some pulled chicken sandwiches for my lunch this week. It's going to be very tasty. And that just pulled like nothing. And we're going to stick it back into the slow cooker. much I think we had four pieces in here so we're gonna make sure whoo we get all of them out so we get them all pulled kind of fun to get them out because they're just very very tender and we're just gonna go ahead and pull the rest of this Wow, it smells really, really good. So we're going to put all this chicken back in here and we're going to give it a whirl inside um, the slow cooker to get it all woo, caked with the sauce. Wow, it looks really, really good. And now we'll take a taste. And okay, now it's time to plate it up. I think a lot of this I'm going to be using for my lunch. But we'll just put some on here so I can take a taste. It would be really good on a nice roll, like a hamburger roll. Can you with rice? Uh, not really with rice, but definitely on a bun, that's for sure. Gonna get a little extra sauce on here. Wow. Looks really, really good. Okay, so let's take a taste. Mmm. <clears throat> wow. The sauce is really, really good. And the chicken is really tender. Mmm. Wow. This is going to be great. On a nice roll for lunch. The sauce is a little tangy. Can chase, taste the chipotle a little bit. Mmm. <laughs> it is really good. Not quite pulled chicken off the smoker, but definitely a great substitute out of this slow cooker. Wow. If you like this recipe, please subscribe below and visit my website at amylearnstocook.com. I'm also on Twitter at twitter.com slash amylearnstocook.